Sairam all of you. In the last session uh, we have learned matrix multiplication and uh, we have solved uh, only 4 problems there. And uh, today uh, in this session we are going to solve uh, more complicated problems and those problems uh, will be for 5 marks uh, for your examinations. And the, these questions are compulsory questions. Uh, let us start with an example number 5. Here uh, the question is they have given a matrix A of order 3 by 3 and we have to show that see the equation they have given a q minus 6 a square plus 7 a plus 2 a is equal to 0. That is what we have to show here where capital I represents the identity matrix of order 3 into 3. We have matrix A is equal to 1 0 2 0 to 1 and 2 0 3. The matrix A is given and we have to prove that a cube minus 6 a square plus 7 a plus 2 i is equal to 0. Here we have matrix A, first we have to find a square. So, what is a square? a into a. So, already we have a, you just uh, multiply it, it will give a square 1 0 2 0 2 1 2 0 3 into 1 0 2 0 2 1 2 0 3. Now, uh, as we know that uh, matrix multiplication, first row, first column. 1 into 1, 1 plus 0 into 0, 0 plus 2 into 2, 4. 1 into 0, 0 plus 0 into 2, 0 plus 2 into 0, 0. Next, 1 into 2, 2 plus 0 into 1, 0 plus 2 into 3, 6. Next, similarly, uh, second row, first column and second row, second column, second row, third column. We will get the second row of A square. So, that is 0 into 1, 0 plus 2 into 0, 0 plus 1 into 2, 2. See, 0 into 1, 0 plus 2 into 0, 0, 1 into 2 is 2. Next, 0 into 0, 0 plus 2 into 2, 4 plus 1 into 0, 0. 0 into 2, 0 plus 2 into 1, 2 plus 1 into 3, 3. Similarly, we will uh, have uh, third row of a square 2 into 1, 2 plus 0 into 0, 0 plus 2 into 3, 6. Next, 2 into 2, 4 plus 0 into 1, 0 plus 3 into 3, 9. Next, 2 into 2, 4 plus 0 into 1, 0 plus 3 into 3, 9. 0, sorry, 2 into 0 is 0, 0 into 2, 0 and uh, 3 into 0 is 0. So, what is a square now? a square is you just add the terms and uh, put it 1 plus 4, 5, 0, 2 plus 6, 8, uh, 2, 4, 5 and this is 8, 0, 4 plus 9, 13. This is a square. Next, we have to find a cube. How are we going to find a cube? a cube is a into a square. What is this? What is a? a is 1, 0, 2, 0, 2, 1, 2, 0, 3 into a square. We already know that. We already found a square is 5, 0, 8, 2, 4, 5, 0, 8, 0, 13. So, again as usual we have to uh, get the row into column multiplication. 
that gives yeah continue this i'll write it write this step again uh, because of uh, z 102 0 2 1 2 0 3 into 5 0 8 2 4 5 8 0 13 so again do the same thing as we done for a square uh, you just do the row into column multiplication to get the cube 1 into 5 5 plus 0 into 2 0 2 into 8 16 again uh, 1 into 0 0 plus 0 plus 0 and 1 into 8 plus 0 into 5 uh, plus 2 into 13 next 0 into 5 0 2 into 2 4 plus 1 into 8 is 8 next uh, 0 into 0 0 plus 2 into 4 8 plus 1 into 0 is 0 next 0 into 8 is 0 plus 2 into 5 10 plus 1 into 13 is 13 2 into 5 10 0 plus 8 3 is a 24 uh, 0 plus 0 plus 0 uh, 16 plus 0 plus 13 3 is a 39. Next, what is a cube now? a cube is 5 plus 16, 21, 0, uh, 8 plus 26 is uh, 34, and 8 plus 12, 8, 23, uh, 34, 0, uh, 16 plus 39, so 55. Now, this is a cube. Now, we have uh, a square, a cube as well as a. By using all this, I can substitute in the given equation uh, in order to I will get a 0. So, we will substitute that in the above equation. So, I will substitute that a cube minus 6 a square plus 7 a plus 2 i is equal to 0. I will substitute here. So, I will uh, rub up this. Yeah. What is a cube? We have a cube is 21, 0, 34, 12, 8, 23, 34, 0, 55, minus 6 a square. What is a square? Here we have 5, 0, 8, 2, 4, 5 and 8, 0, 13. Next, what do we have? plus 7a, I will continue here, 7a is what is a, 1, 0, 2, 0, 2, 1, 0, 3, 0, 2, 1, 2, 0, 3 plus 2i, i in the sense here the identity matrix of order 3 into 3, so this is identity matrix of order 3 into 3, so we have to show that this is equal to a 0, so I will continue here. So, let us simplify that which is equal to a cube is again 21, 0, 34, 12, 8, 23, 34, 0, 55 minus you multiply that 6 to each element of the matrix 6, 5 is a 30, 0, 48, 12, uh, 24, uh, 30, uh, 48, 0, uh, 6 13 is a uh, 78 uh, plus 7 uh, times a. You multiply 7 here, 7, 0, 14, 0, 14, 7, 14, 0, 7 3 is a 21 and similarly you multiply the 2, 2 0 0, 0 2 0, 
0 0 2 and now let us uh, simplify this. See look at here 21 minus 30 minus 9 plus 7 minus 2 plus 2 minus 2 plus 2 becomes a 0. Similarly here next element 0 minus 0 plus 0 plus 0 everything is 0. Next 34 minus 48 which is minus 16 so, uh, sorry 34 minus 48 is minus 14 plus 14 0 plus 0 0. 12 minus 12 0 plus 0 0. 8 minus 24 minus 16 plus 16 14 plus 2 16 minus 16 0. 23 minus 30 minus 7 plus 7 plus 0 0. 34 minus 48 which is minus 14 plus 14 it is also 0 and here 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0. 0. 55 minus 78 minus 23 plus 21 plus 2 plus 23 here minus 23 minus 23 plus 23 becomes 0 and everything is 0 this is a 0 matrix. So, I can represent 0 thus we got a cube minus 6 a square plus 7 a uh, plus 2 i is equal to 0. Hence, we got the proof. See next problem we have here uh, a is uh, 3 minus 2 4 minus 2 and the identity matrix already they have given and here by using this equation uh, a square is equal to k minus 2 i we have to find the value of k that is the question here. So, let us find the value of k. See first we have to find a square. So, 3 minus 2 4 minus 2 a into a gives a square uh, 3 minus 2 4 minus 2. So, again you multiply this 2 in order to get a square 3 into 3 9 minus 8 minus 6 plus 4 uh, 3 4 is a 12 minus 8 uh, minus 8 plus 4 what is a square here 9 minus 8 1 uh, minus 2 and here uh, 4 and this is uh, minus 4 this is a square ok. Now, we have to using that equation to get the value of k a square I will consider this equation k a minus 2 i uh, as you know that a square we already got that is uh, 1 minus 2 4 minus 4 which is equal to k times a what is a uh, 3 minus 2 4 minus 2 minus 2 times i 1 0 0 1. Here you multiply k and add this to uh, we will get 3 k minus 2 k uh, 4 k minus 2 k and minus 2 0 uh, 0 2 you just subtract this. Uh, let us continue this 1 minus 2 4 minus 4 is equal to you just subtract each element 3 k minus 2 and uh, 2k minus 0 minus 2k and 4k and uh, here which is uh, minus 2k and uh, minus 2 that is a corresponding element. So, now these are the these two matrices are equal if the equal means we have to equate the each corresponding element of this matrix as well as this. So, let us take the first element 3k minus 2 is equal to 1. 3k is equal to you send this minus to other side it will get 1 2 plus 1 3k is equal to 3 as you divide uh, 3 on both sides so we will get k is equal to 1. Since thus k is equal to 1 we got the value of k you can substitute anywhere else here you will get the same value of the other one. See if you put k here as 1 minus 2 is equal to minus 2 and here put k 1 you will get 4 equal to 4 and put k here minus 2 minus 2 will become minus 4 thus the value of k is correct. Next, uh, next problem we have uh, a is given the matrix a is given uh, 
and identity matrix of order 2 and we have to show that the given statement i plus a is equal to i minus a times of cos alpha minus sin alpha sin alpha and cos alpha we have to show this. So, let us start with the solution of the problem. See i is let us find this uh, LHS, LHS is i plus a, i is the matrix of order 1 by 1 this one plus a, a is given what is a? Uh, 0 minus tan alpha by 2 tan alpha by 2 and 0. So, let us add this. So, it will give 1 plus 0 is 1 minus tan alpha by 2 tan alpha by 2 1 plus 0 is 1. This is LHS. Now, we have to show that LHS is equal to RHS. Now, let us consider RHS. RHS is I minus A times that matrix. So, I minus A, I minus A times cos alpha minus sin alpha, sin alpha into cos alpha. So, let us uh, write the identity matrix here. So, that is 1 0 0 1 minus A, A is 0 minus tan alpha by 2, tan alpha by 2 uh, 0. So, next matrix is, see inside we have to subtract and then we multiply the whole matrix to that matrix. So, which is cos alpha minus sin alpha, sin alpha and cos alpha. So, let us uh, subtract this. So, which is 1 minus 0 is 1, 0 minus of minus it will be tan alpha by 2 and 0 minus tan alpha by 2 which is minus tan alpha by 2 and the 1 minus 0 is 1 into cos alpha minus sin alpha, sin alpha and cos alpha. Next uh, multiply this is equal to 1 into cos alpha is cos alpha plus I will write uh, instead of writing tan alpha by 2 into sin alpha by 2, I will write sin alpha into tan alpha by 2, tan alpha by 2 and this 1 into minus sin is uh, minus sin alpha plus cos alpha into tan alpha by 2 and this minus cos alpha into tan alpha by 2 plus sin alpha next minus into minus becomes plus sin alpha into tan alpha by 2 plus cos alpha. Now, here uh, we know the half angle formula for sin as well as cos as we know that sin theta is what? 2 sin theta by 2 into cos theta by 2 and one more formula for cos theta is 2 cos square theta by 2 minus 1 or uh, we can write 1 minus 2 sin square theta by 2. So, I will use these two formulas in the above equation uh, above elements of the matrix. So, that I will get the LHS. So, which is cos alpha. I will use this formula 1 minus 2 sin square theta by sorry, I will use alpha by 2 since it is alpha 2 sin square alpha by 2 plus what is sin alpha? 2 sin alpha by 2 into cos alpha by 2 and tan alpha is nothing but sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2. Now, apply the formula for sin alpha because your space is not enough, I will continue there. 
plus cos alpha tan alpha by 2 minus cos alpha into tan alpha by 2 plus sin alpha and here uh, sin alpha into tan alpha by 2 plus cos alpha. See anyhow we have uh, LHS. Now I will continue from here from that step so that you will get to know LHS is equal to RHS. Yeah, that is RHS is equal to 1 minus 2 sin square alpha by 2 plus 2 sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 into sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2 and next is minus 2 sin alpha by 2 into cos alpha by 2 for sin theta formula plus for cos, I am going to use this that is 2 cos square alpha by 2 minus 1 into tan alpha by 2. What is tan alpha by 2? That is sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2. Next is the same formula here also you can use it. Minus cos alpha is 1 minus 2 cos square alpha by 2 into tan alpha by 2 is sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2 plus sin alpha is 2 sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 and next is 2 sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 into sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2 this is for tan alpha by 2 plus I am going to use cos alpha as this formula that is 1 minus 2 uh, sin square alpha by 2. So, let us continue this here listen here here cos square alpha by 2 and cos square alpha by 2 get cancelled and here what do we left with 1 minus 2 sin square alpha by 2 plus 2 times sin square sin in alpha by 2 sin alpha by 2 it is sin square alpha by 2 and here we have minus 2 sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 plus multiply this one of the cos will get cancelled and we have sin alpha by 2 into cos alpha by 2. Once we multiply to this minus what is this sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2. In the same way here also we do it you multiply this sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2 minus here you see if you multiply this here this one of the cos, al, cos and this will get cancelled so that we have 2 sin alpha by 2 into cos alpha by 2 plus already we have 2 sin alpha by 2 into cos alpha by 2 and here <coughs> this one uh, one of the cos will get cancelled so that we have 2 sin square alpha by 2 plus 1 minus 2 sin square alpha by 2 understand see first element, second element, third and fourth element as uh, now see here minus 2 sin square plus 2 sin square will get cancelled and here minus 2 sin alpha by 2 plus 2 sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 get cancelled and we left with minus sin alpha by 2 divided by cos alpha by 2 and here also the same thing these two terms will get cancelled this plus and this minus will get cancelled. So, at the finally we have 1 and here and here minus sin, sin alpha by 2 cos alpha by 2 which is nothing but minus tan alpha by 2 and here everything goes up for we left with only sin alpha by 2 by cos alpha by 2 is tan alpha by 2 and here everything is cancelled we left with only 1 so which is 1 see look at now LHS and RHS so look at the matrix of LHS which is same as the matrix of RHS hence we uh, arrived at the proof. Hence, uh, this is proved. Yeah, another question. Actually, this is a five mark question. Uh, we have here three matrices, and we have to calculate A, C, B, C, and A plus B of C, and also we have to verify the distributive law. So let us start with this example. 
uh, first we have to find a plus b into c a plus b first we have to find a plus b what is a 0 6 7 minus 6 0 8 7 minus 8 0 plus uh, b is a 0 1 1 1 0 2 1 2 0 you can add this uh, what is this 0 plus 0 is 0 6 plus 1 7 7 plus 1 8 6 minus 6 plus 1 minus 5 0 plus 0 0 Z, uh, 8 plus 2 10 8 minus 6 0 this is a plus b ok now we have to find a plus b times c now a plus b is this 0 7 8 minus 5 0 10 8 minus 6 0 into c what is c 2 minus 2 3 see one thing we have to observe here that is the order of this matrix is 3 into 3 and the order of this matrix is 3 into 1 see we can multiply this uh, 3 into 1 see number of columns is equal to the number of rows in the second matrix so we can multiply this that is multiply 0 first row first column 0 into 2 0 7 into 0 minus 14 uh, 8 into 3 24 next minus 10 0 plus 30 and uh, 16 plus 12 uh, plus 0 that is an matrix is uh, 20, 20, 10 8 and this is 20 and this is uh, 28 now we got uh, I will call it as 1 a plus of c is this one next we have to find next we have to find a c b c what is a c a c is a is 0 6 7 minus 6 0 8 7 minus 8 0 into c is a uh, 2 minus 2 3 so as usual you can multiply which is equal to first row first column 0 minus 12 plus 7 3 is a 21 and here minus 12 plus 0 plus 24 and here 14 plus 16 plus 0. So, what is AC now? AC is uh, 9 and is uh, 12 uh, and this is 30. I will call it as 2. Still, uh, we have to find BC. BC is 0, 6, 7, minus 6, 0, 8, 7, sorry, B is 0 1 1 1 0 2 1 2 0 into C 2 minus 2 3 multiply this uh, 0 uh, minus 2 plus 3 and 2 plus 0 plus 6 and here what is this? Mm. 2 minus 4 plus 0 yeah so now what is this 1 8 and uh, this is uh, 2 minus 4 0 which is minus 2 this is BC call it as 3 now we have to show that uh, now we found uh, a plus b times c and we have to find ac plus bc that is uh, ac you can add uh, 2 plus 3 will get ac plus bc is equal to what is uh, ac 9 12 30 plus 
B C is 1 8 minus 2 and uh, you can add this two matrix 1 plus 1 plus 9 is 10 12 plus 8 is uh, 20 and uh, 30 minus 2 is 28 you can call it as equation 4. Now, you look at uh, equation uh, 1 and 4. So, the distributive law is satisfied. So, then uh, we can verify that a plus b times of c is equal to a c plus b c. Hence, we have verified the distributive law as well as we found a c b c and a plus b of c. Uh, here the problem is a trust has uh, 30,000 rupees and uh, the trust has to invest in two different bonds and here the pro here the first bond pays 5 percent per year as interest and bond 2 pays 7 percent uh, as an interest per year and we have to use a matrix multiplication we have to divide uh, this 30,000 amount in order to get 1,800 rupees as a uh, annual income. Similarly, the another problem as well. So, that is the 2,000 as a annual income so that we have to divide this uh, 30,000 in order to get uh, 2,000 as an annual income. So, let us we do not know how much amount we have to invest in two different bonds may paying the two different uh, uh, interest uh, per annum. So, let us uh, take here uh, x is the amount that invest in uh, bond 1 and similarly another amount as uh, obviously which is 30,000 minus x which is in a uh, second bond. So, by using matrix method we can say x 30,000 minus x into here the first bond pays 5 percent per annum that is 5 by 100 and second bond uh, pays uh, 7 percent per annum that is 7 by 100 which is equal to 1800. So, matrix multiplication 5 x by 100 plus 30,000 x times 7 by 100 is equal to 1800. See here uh, this is a uh, this matrix has only one element and this matrix has also having one element that is 1 by 1 order. So, we can equate this that is uh, 5 x by 100 plus 30,000 minus x 7 by 100 is equal to 1800. Take LCM and do simplification 5 x plus 30,000 minus x into 7 is equal to 1 lakh 0 0 0. So, 1 lakh 80,000 and uh, you simplify this 5 x plus uh, 2 lakh uh, 0 0 0 and uh, 0 minus 7 x is equal to 1 lakh 80,000. So, you simplify this 5 x minus 7 x is minus 2 x and send this to that side it will be if you send that to side uh, it will be minus 30,000 and divide uh, minus and minus it will get cancelled divide 2 on both side you will get uh, x is equal to uh, 15,000. See I can invest uh, 15,000 in first bond and uh, how much amount uh, we can uh, invest in second bond as uh, 30,000. Uh, rupees as the trust has. So, another uh, amount we can easily find 30,000 minus x it will be 30,000 minus x we already found x is as a 15,000. So, another amount is also of uh, same 15,000. So, we have to invest 15,000 and 15,000 in two different bonds in order to get 1800 rupees as a annual income. Similarly, we do the second uh, problem as well, but uh, the income is uh, 2000 uh, per year. So, let us uh, continue the same thing from here. So, that is x 30,000 minus x into 5 by 100, 7 by 100 is equal to 2000. So, now as uh, multiply and equate it. So, which is a 5 x by 100 plus 30,000 minus x into 7 by 100 is equal to 2000. 
see these are the equal matrix of the same order. So, we can equate it 5 x by 100 plus 30,000 minus x into 7 by 100 is equal to 2000. So, take the LCM and do simplification 5 x plus uh, 30,000 minus x times 7 is equal to 2 0 0 0 0 0 and uh, simplify. So, 5 x plus 0 0 0 0 minus 7 x is equal to 2 0 0 0 0 and uh, what is this minus 2 x is equal to if you send to that side it will be 10,000 minus 10,000 minus and minus get cancelled x is equal to 5000. So, in first bond uh, we can invest 5000 and uh, how you what is the in, uh, next amount that we invest in bond 2 is 30,000 minus x. This gives 30,000 minus 5000 gives 25,000. So, here the two different amounts are 5000 and 25000 we can invest in two different bonds paying different uh, uh, interest. So, that we can get uh, 2000 as an annual income. As of now, uh, we have completed uh, addition of matrix and uh, multiplication of matrix and uh, different properties regarding to these two algebraic terms. And uh, in this, uh, we have to uh, practice lot more uh, matrix multiplication problems. Uh, see, the problems looks very easy, but uh, uh, the complicated thing is uh, when you multiplying, when you adding. Uh, so, something of the other one of the element becomes wrong in the matrix then the entire uh, solution becomes wrong. So, this is a very easy scoring uh, chapter. So, you can easily score uh, 5 to 6 marks uh, anyhow oh, today we have uh, solved uh, the problems these problems for 5 marks. So, practice more and more problems on multiplication. In the next session we are going to talk about uh, uh, transpose of matrix. There also we will have uh, multiplication of matrix. So, in order to uh, overcome of this difficulty, we have to practice more problems on multiplication. Till then, Sarah.